Hi there folks, this is Levi Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, your Class B and B Plus RV specialists. Please check out our website, www.truckandrv.com. That's truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. We do not put any pricing on YouTube, so if you have any price inquiries, uh, please jump over to our website where all of our prices are listed, or feel free to give us a call. We are a full service dealer. We do offer warranty as well as financing packages. If you have any questions on those, please call my brother Luke in our office at 419-899-2020. For sale today, we have a 1999 Great West Class B motorhome. Alright folks, it's time for the inside portion of today's video tour. I am currently sitting in the driver's seat of this Great West van. I'll make my way to the back and then back towards the front to try to get you a few different angles so you can get a feel of what it's like to be inside of this RV. Along the passenger side we have the kitchen area. This unit was built as a 100% as far as the RV part of this goes electric unit. Uh, there is no propane tank. Uh, the major systems that would normally run on propane would be your stovetop, uh, your refrigerator, and your furnace. All three of those are electric. So you can power everything be it either being plugged in uh, via the shore power cord or the built-in Onan generator. Wardrobe closet directly behind the driver's seat also stores the table and a couple of the table legs. Directly above that, microwave and coffee maker. Behind the two doors with the mirror on them is the wet bath. I'll show you that in a second. Kitchen area, refrigerator down bottom. Again, that's a 100% electric unit. Kitchen sink. Two burner cooktop, 100% electric. Toaster oven. Some storage up top. On the range hood, we've got your gauges. Hold the test button, show you how much is in each one. Water pump and range hood light. Again, opposite that is the wet bath. A wet bath, essentially they combine the toilet, the shower, the bathroom sink, all of that into one space uh, for the footprint in these smaller units. Shower curtain that you pull around you. And in the very rear uh, is the bedroom. Kind of got a U-shaped couch in the seating position uh, when you want to sleep. Grab these, slide them across, span this gap here. You guys just clean the floor, it's pretty squeaky. Um, slide those across. And then you rearrange your cushions to make this into one big bed. This will sleep two people back here uh, for a total sleeping capacity of two people. Remote start switch for the Onan generator is up there. Uh, we've got a CO detector up top. Brand new 19 inch flat screen uh, TV installed by my guys. This has a built in DVD player. Uh, all the TVs we put in, we try to put in with built in DVD players. It's just a lot more uh, simple, a lot easier to use. Uh, 
Uh, one of the advantages of this being a 100% electric unit is that you never have to mess with the propane tank. You don't have to worry about being full of propane. You fill the gas tank in this baby and you are ready to rock and roll because the generator runs off of the regular gas tank, uh, which will power you. And then also you can get to wherever you want to go and plug in with the shore power cord when you get there. Fantastic fan in the ceiling. These great wests are a little bit higher top than, say, your road trick or pleasure way, uh, which gives you a little more headroom. If you're a taller person, makes it a little more comfortable. Storage compartment up front overhead. I am standing directly inside of the rear walk-in door and myself with my shoes on, I'm about 6'3", maybe 6'3 and a half. Uh, I am standing here without my head touching the ceiling, which is rare for most of these class B's, usually my head rubs. Uh, still standing between the front seats and my head is, I've got an inch or two between my head and the ceiling. Um, now granted, I couldn't stand all the way back. Basically from this hump forward, I can stand without issue. Uh, when I get towards the rear, the light hangs down a little bit, my head bumps onto that. Then we get back to the air conditioner and uh, my head hits that as well. If you have any questions on this unit, please give us a call at Coon Truck and RV the best little RV dealership around. Thank you for watching this video. I put these together not only for our potential customers, but as well as everybody else out there on YouTube so you can get a feel of what it's like to be inside of this RV. If you like this video, please like, comment, and share, and please subscribe to our channel. Thank you and have a good day.